Hi guys, welcome to another video. Uh, today's video topic is if you want to claim asylum in the UK as a refugee. So I'll try to cover uh, in depth this topic as much as possible. So stay tuned and let's begin. First thing to claim asylum in the UK is uh, you need to prove that you have a fear of persecution in your own country. Now persecution is a legal terminology and it's, it's used in several ways but the basically in simple way is that uh, in your own country you, uh, you will fear that uh, you will be tortured or even be killed. So first thing this needs to be proven. And then on what basis? So there are, few, there are quite few bases which you can show this fear of persecution. This can be due to your, your race, your nationality, your gender, your religious belief, or even though even your political opinion. So any of these which uh, you can prove that you have a grounds to show to the authorities that uh, if you go back to your country, you will suffer persecution. So you will have a solid ground to apply refugee status in UK. Now before you apply on these bases, you, you also need to show the evidence that your own country has failed to protect you from the situation. So now for example, it's uh, due to say any political instability in your account and the other party is in power and then you are fear that you are you are or you will be tortured or persecuted or even be killed and you try to complain the authorities such as police or any other relevant authorities in your country but they are not acting in their good faith or they're not really protecting you from that so that that is the ground with, with the, the, the possible points you need to show. Now there are certain circumstances when your case, your case or your asylum case will not be considered as legit or solid if you belong to some countries which are part of European Union or you have traveled to UK through a safe third country. So safe third country mean where you were before you okay, and they offer asylum as well and uh, and you have a no fear of persecution there or you have a connection with any family or friend in any other third country as compared to your own country where you can actually claim asylum so if you have all these things you your claim will be very difficult in the UK so if you are if you are a family member you have your family people with you, your dependents or your wife or your children, you can apply uh, asylum for them as well at the same time with you or even if you have a children or your age is under the 18. So you, you can apply on your own as a dependent person. So it depends on your circumstances and your different scenarios of your life. So next question is when to apply this asylum. So, so the advisable thing is uh, to apply for this asylum as refugees as soon as you enter in the UK. If you delay for a very long time, it will make your case a bit weak. But however, if you are already in the UK and you, you are in the situation where you fear persecution going back to your country, you still can apply it. There is no restriction or prohibition to that. So you should be able to apply either way, but it's uh, uh, suggested and advisable as soon as you enter the UK just to apply for this if you are in that category. So what will happen when you apply? So the first thing is if you, like say, you're crossing the border and you come to UK, you will you will meet a, is a officer, there's a meeting officer there and uh, who will take you a uh, short screening. So after that screening, home office will decide if you have sufficient ground 
to get asylum in the UK and then they will arrange an asylum interview with the, a caseworker. And once you get interviewed, they say uh, generally it takes up to six months uh, till your case is decided. So now in that six months, while you are waiting for the decision, the Home Office might tell you to report to a certain place as a, or report to a certain authorities so you stay in contact with them or it's your responsibility if you if your circumstances in your country change and you don't want to go ahead with the application so you need to tell that to the authorities as soon as you become aware and remember don't provide any false information this because this can lead lead you up to two years imprisonment or uh, departing the country so that's it guys for this video this was uh, information on claiming asylum in the UK and living as a refugee so I hope you find some useful information in this and if you have any more in-depth or detailed information about any anything just just comment to this video and I'll I'll reply as soon as possible and do my best to accommodate your comments thank you bye